Welcome to a new episode of Medicine in 3 minutes. We go straight to the point. The subject is bravely made clear and awfully illustrated. Let's start. Today's topic is about spondyloarthropathies. It's a big family of spondyloarthropathies. Include ankylosing spondylitis, psoriasis arthritis, reactive arthritis, juvenile spondylarthritis, and differentiated spondylarthritis, and IBD arthritis. A second classification let distinguish between axial spondylitis and peripheral spondylarthritis. Axial spondylitis include chest, spine, and hip. Peripheral spondylitis include fingers, knee, and toe. Ankylosing spondylitis. During this presentation, we will deal with ankylosing spondylitis, a reactive arthritis, first after enter evasive diarrhea compilobacter, and second after no gonoxical urethritis, chlamydia rater syndrome. Then we'll talk about psoriasis arthritis, and then enteropathic arthritis associated with inflammatory bowel disease. Ankylosing spondylitis, two characteristics, lower back, back pain and sacroiliac joint fusion. Inflammation is chronic. Radiologic look, look for bamboo spine sign. Ankylosing spondylitis started two or three decades of life. Prevalence three or to four men to one woman. In most of autoimmune predominant in women, except spondylitis, is an exception. Associated with HLA-B27 in 90%, but not use it for diagnosis because 10 to 15% of normal population has HLA-B27 positive. Sacroiliac joint lower back pain and fusion of sacroiliac joint. Decreased spine mobility back against the wall. Patient cannot touch the feet with finger. Can lead to spine fracture, even with a minimal trauma because inflexibility. X-ray sacroiliitis and bamboo spine scarring. Patient cannot touch the feet with fingers. Fibrosis is a normal spine and nearly ankylosing in advanced ankylosing. Psoriasis arthritis is similar to ankylosing spondylitis plus psoriasis may be subtle back of the air or back of the elbow Examine the patient very closely. Now, gonococcal urethritis by chlamydia, urea plasma, or mycoplasma. We call that Rader syndrome. Conjunctivitis, arthritis, musculocutaneous manifestation, including keratoderma, which is the thickening of palm and sole of the feet and blenorrhagy, circinate balanitis, erythema around the penis, oral genital ulcer are painful in Rater syndrome. They are not painful in syphilis. Aggressive form is commonly seen in patients with, with HI. Rater syndrome, three characteristics, conjunctivitis, urethritis, arthritis. Can see, can pee, and can climb. Circinate balanitis is a skin condition of reactive arthritis comprising a 
very genial, saving shape, dermatite of the grand penis. Palmo plantar keratoderma thickening in the skin. NGU, nogonoxal urethritis, is an inflammation of the urethra that is not caused by gonococci uh, infection. The diagnosis of genital chlamydia infection by not nucleic acid amplification test may be performed and swab specimen from the cervix woman, urethra for men, not has been estimated to have a sensitivity of 90% in and specificity on 99%. We ask the question, is it possible to give antibiotic for HIV and Reiter syndrome? The question is yes, because there is no treatment for reactive arthritis except for Reiter syndrome. We use antibiotic for two or three weeks. Among patients with IBD or Crohn's disease, women with a history of at least one biological or immunosuppressive therapy are at all in increased risk for developing spondylitis. Enteropathic arthritis sometimes occur before the onset of the disease. Juvenile spondylarthropathy is characterized by a period of mild to moderate inflammation flare between times of desiccations. Peripheral or hip arthritis is the most common presentation feature in children. And differentiated spondylarthritis symptoms are present but are not distinctive enough to make a specific diagnosis. Remember, ankylosing spondylitis, lower back pain, and sacroiliac joint fusion. Inflammation is chronic. Radiology look for bamboo spine sign. Patient cannot touch the feet with fingers. Psoriasis arthritis is similar to AS plus psoriasis. May be subtle. Look for the back of the ear or the back of the elbow. You have to examine the patient closely. Writer, think about conjunctivitis, urethritis, and arthritis. You cannot see, cannot pee, and cannot climb. IBD and Crohn, there is some predisposition for uh, spondyl arthritis. Thank you for watching this episode of Medicine in 3 Minutes. Would you like to click the button like and subscribe? Your comments are very welcome. Thank you.